Israeli ambassador to the U.S. Michael Herzog said Sunday that his country has no desire to reoccupy the Hamas-governed Gaza Strip amid the country's ongoing conflict with the Palestinian-based militant group. During an appearance on CNN's State of the Union, host Jake Tapper asked Herzog if there are any plans for Israel to reoccupy Gaza and if Palestinians who fled the area will be allowed back in. So, we have no desire to occupy or reoccupy Gaza, Herzog told Tapper. We have no desire to rule over the lives of over 2 million Palestinians. And, certainly, we want people to go back to their homes. We are talking about innocent civilians. And we are doing everything we can to keep them out of harm's way, while Hamas is doing everything it can to keep them in harm's way. That's the situation we are at. Herzog added. I think talking about the day after is a bit premature, because crushing the Hamas war machine will require time. The questions you raise are valid, and I think we will have to enter discussions with our partners, with the international community, about the day after. Herzog's remarks come a week after Hamas, a militant group that governs Gaza, launched its deadly attack against Israel. The week old war has claimed more than 3,600 lives across Israel and Gaza. Israeli armed forces have launched its counteroffensive against the militant group, with Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu saying that his country's forces will exact a huge price against Hamas for the attack. It's been 18 years since Israel withdrew its settlers and military forces from the Gaza Strip under the order of the Israeli Prime Minister, Ariel Sharon.